You're used to seeing reporters like me stand in places like this. But before I appear on your screen, there's a long, thorough process to make sure that we uphold our standards and what we're reporting is fair, accurate, and true. When it comes to politics, the idea for a story might start here, in the halls of the U.S. Capitol. Could be a tip from a source, a key piece of legislation, or a question from one of our 70 bureaus and stations across the country. It's a similar process here at the White House, where Scripps reporters and producers work hand-in-hand -hand with our teams across the country working to get to the truth. As Scripps News Politics Director, I'm in constant contact with our politics team, talking about how to cover the biggest stories of the day all through the lens of what matters to you, the viewer, most. And we bring those ideas to our company-wide editorial meetings. Every available Scripps News employee is on these calls. We talk through ideas, we craft them, because we want to make sure our stories are relevant to your life. But we're always searching for the truth and we're always striving to be fair. Each show on Scripps News has an entire editorial team behind it, working together to bring the ideas to life, thinking about every aspect of what you see and hear. We work in a program called iNews, and in here we put graphics, on-screen text, even anchor scripts. I review what I'm going to say with a team of Scripps News editors. They check for things like accuracy and fairness. This is the last stop, the control room. Another team here brings the story to life. And that's the process, an entire team spread out across the country, all making sure that the information we're reporting, you can trust. I'm Nathaniel Reed at the U.S. Capitol.